Well, I grew up here in Taos, New Mexico. Uh, during World War II, my parents moved all around, but they moved back here immediately after the war, and I've been here ever since. Uh, my granddad came here in 1898 the first time, and, and just he liked it here, so he ended up staying. And he, by the 20s, my granddad built his house and started bringing the whole family out here. One of my aunts, uh, Belle McCausland, built the uh, Sagebrush Inn originally back in 1934 or thereabouts. Uh, my mother came here actually in the 30s to uh, study with Andrew Dasberg uh, and end up staying and meeting my dad who, uh, actually my mom I think rented my grandfather's house over on the Lomo back sometime in the late 30s and met my dad that way. She does what's called academic impressionism, which is what everybody was taught back then in college. I used to walk along with her and uh, we'd go looking for places to paint and I had a little set of watercolors and she had her easel and set up for standing up and painting oils along the roads. And, uh, I can just remember going along with her way back and sitting on the ground and drawing and scribbling and watercolor. And in high school I got into taking art classes always and I kept trying to avoid it. I started majoring in psychology after I'd done the year of, of architecture and a couple of years of that I realized I wasn't going anywhere with that. <laughs> I couldn't know what I would do and meanwhile I'd been painting all along on the side because I was an illustrator the time I was in the military so I just kept working on uh, doing painting and then I found this teacher Sam Smith and I took a class with him that was an elective and I started getting A's from him. I ended up with a total of a um, minor in Sam Smith with 18 hours of A at UNM so it didn't make much sense to do anything else at that point. And then I started selling paintings in the galleries here early on back in the late 60s and I've just been doing that ever since. I was influenced by Victor Higgins to a great deal with his color, uh, use of color and his simplification of design, I would say, which is something I've done gradually over the years. Don't try and put too much in a painting. I'd say I just was born to be an artist.